Rocky Island in Cork Harbour has played a central role in the history of the harbour. In the early 19th century, England was a major colonial power and Cork Harbour was an important anchor for its naval fleet. Its size and narrow mouth made it ideal as a refuge and was easy to defend. A naval dockyard was established on Hull Bolan and forts constructed or redeveloped on both sides of the harbour mouth and on the nearby Spike Island. The construction work on Rocky Island began in 1808. It consisted of two magazine buildings built into solid rock, lighting passageways and a central watchtower. It took 10 years to finish. The building was used as a magazine for storing 25,000 barrels of gunpowder. It continued in military use as a store until 1923, when the dockyard on Hall Bolan was handed over to the new Irish state. The island was left vacant and stripped of its oak floors, slate roofs, copper lighting conductors and anything else that could be taken. In August 1939, the Irish state began production of steel on Hall Bolan. The bridge that bisects the island was constructed in 1966, allowing easier access to Hall Bolan from the mainland. This destroyed the Eastern magazine, but this probably saved the remaining buildings as the steel company could then utilize the other magazine for storage. After 62 years of production, the steel plant went into liquidation in 2001. Rocky Island was purchased by the Island Crematorium Company Limited in February 2005 and after restoration was opened in December 2006.